हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू पेबल्स एंड वेलकम टू आवर स्पोकन हिंदी थ्रू इंग्लिश क्लास नमस्ते हमारे स्पोकन हिंदी संभाषणात्मक हिंदी थ्रू इंग्लिश की क्लास में आप सभी का स्वागत है आगे जाने से पहले हम आपको बताना चाहते हैं याद दिलाना चाहते हैं वी वॉन्ट टू रिक्वेस्ट यू टू प्लीज सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल शेयर अवर वीडियोज एंड इफ यू लाइक इट डेफिनेटली लाइक ऑल्सो प्लीज Uh, comment your views, your suggestions. Uh, we personally watch yes. and answer all the comments. So let us start today. We have seen, uh, I think, uh, one animal video. one. We have already seen. Now we will see few more animals, uh, common animals which are found in India. Uh, so let us start that. The animals in Hindi are called as janwar. So janwar is a word which is used in Hindi for common animals. अब जानवर के अंदर इंसेक्ट्स भी आ सकते हैं yeah. बड़े एनिमल्स छोटे एनिमल्स बटरफ्लाइज एनीथिंग विच एवर इज एनिमल सो इट विल कम अंडर इट नाउ एज जानवर इज अ अगेन हिंदी वर्ड बट स्टिल इफ यू वांट टू गो फॉर द प्योर हिंदी यू कैन कॉल देम एज अ प्राणी आल्सो ओके सो प्राणी आल्सो यू कैन कॉल और यू कैन कॉल देम एज अ जानवर जानवर इज लिटिल बिट विलेज काइंड ऑफ थिंग्स वर्ड एंड प्राणी इज मोर प्योर हिंदी फॉर्म ओके But in general, you can call yes. it as jungle. So let us see the first. The first is a very very common squirrel. Now squirrel in Hindi is called gilhari. 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 Squirrel. No need to introduce yes. you. It's very common in India. All over India, you will find it. And uh, there are many species of it. Yeah, but in general, we say gilhari. Yeah. In Maharashtra, there is one. Specific kind of gilari there, which is called as a shakru, which can fly. Actually, they don't have wings, yeah. but their front and back leg on the both sides are attached with the fine skin, and they can float in the air. And that is the speciality and very rare species in Maharashtra, and only found in Maharashtra only. It's yes. a, a big in uh, size. Generally, in the uh, Auspicious space called as the Bhima Shankar, where the Jyotir Linga is there. There are the twelve Jyotir Lingas. That is the uh, God Shiva's idols are there. Those idols are very auspicious. In that forest, this Shakru, this flying gilari, is always found. Yes. So anyone who is coming to Maharashtra for Jyotir Linga or for the sightseeing or for the game sanctuaries, so uh, if you are lucky, you can yeah, you can see this type of gilari. Okay? Yes. So the next is the panther. Panther, panther in Hindi is called cheetah. Now again, uh, there is a conflict. <laughs> uh, if you search the Google, the panther they call as a cheetah, but actually it is not cheetah. Okay, cheetah is nowadays found only in Africa, from Indian continent, from yes, Asia. It's almost the, extinct. Cheetah is extinct. Now. There is a another species uh, which is exactly similar to cheetah, which is called as the panther. You can easily identify the cheetah is having the black lines from its uh, nose. eyes to mm -hmm. nose, and panther don't have. Also, uh, but because they belong to cat family, yeah. so in general it is called cheetah. Cheetah, yeah. and the sometimes you will find the black panthers also, completely black in color. You might have seen in the Jungle Book uh, film also. The black panther is there. Now those are uh, endangered species and very very uh, means it is protection by yeah. the government is there. So if if you are a traveler and if somebody is offering you the purses, belts or something, so avoid that buying made uh, made by the uh, cheetah skin or panther skin. Avoid it. You will go in jail for twenty years. No bail will be granted. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the next is the rhinoceros. Rhinoceros in Hindi is called genda. it's called genda no it is there is a difference see the pronunciation will be same genda hmm. genda no this is a d d isn't it because the genda is a flower. name of the flower genda is a flower chrysanthemum in hindi in english it is called but it is a yellow color or orange color flowers and it is it is pronounced as genda d no, this is the beauty of hmm. the indian languages yeah This you can, if you are English, you can pronounce it as a genda or genda. 
बट इन हिंदी बोथ द वर्ड आर डिफरेंट देर इज नो डिफरेंट प्रोनाउंसिएशन फॉर एनी वर्ड इन हिंदी दैट इज वॉट द ब्यूटी ऑफ द इंडियन लैंग्वेज सो यू नो दैट देर इज वन हॉर्न and that is also endangered species yeah, it is almost yeah. endangered in yes in india you can uh, find it in the kaziranga in assam yeah so kaziranga national famous, park is very famous very and famous there you will find many rhinoceros yeah, yeah. many rhinoceros the special rides are there uh, through jeep safaris mm-hmm. are there but only there otherwise in zoo also we can see but if you want to see in the real atmosphere you should go to assam kaziranga yeah. national park now all famous is a prawn prawn so very famous uh, dish also it is there prawn curry it is called jhinga in hindi it is called jhinga now india is very famous for the prawns export uh, yeah. from the seafood very, is very famous in india very, very famous. in different types of uh, varieties there it is made yeah. actually all the coastal areas are having yeah. this all prawns all the coastal area western coast eastern coast and inside also see the prawns you can find of the uh, sweet water prawns and uh, salt water mm-hmm. prawns whenever you are the interior interior parts of the india it is very difficult to get the uh, salt water prawns because it is far away from the coast mm-hmm. but you will find it everywhere the taste is totally different for the uh, prawns which is very famous is of salt water mm-hmm. if you are in india always try the tiger prawns there are the black stripes on the prawn it is very very famous seafood in india definitely you try right. anywhere uh, next is the crab now crab in hindi is called kekda kekda this there is a nasal kekda it is a k k it is a nasal word kekda mm-hmm. kekda but if you if you are in the metro cities you can easily uh, call them as a crab, crab it yeah. is very famous and in rural part also even the village people also call them as a crabs no but yes it is famous yeah. as kekda kekda is also people there. say kekda de do so no, uh, yeah. for the kekda you may find is a cuisine like a tandoor kekda that is a roasted right, right. then you will uh, find a curry and it is highly nutritious uh, that means the way the indian people are cooking that is highly nutritious all coastal areas you all will find this prawns and crabs uh, cooked in a different variety yeah and it is very delicious also delicious and highly nutritious. nutritious yes so the next is the bull now bull in hindi is called sand so sand now again the bull is a very very common animal hmm. now recently in india you cannot kill that means uh, the beef is totally banned ban in india so if you are coming to india or avoid that avoid the beef don't Uh, nobody can even offer you but if somebody is offering some hotel is offering you try to avoid that because it is legally banned in india again i am telling you uh, telling you you will directly go into the jail <laughs> straight away i am telling you see because for the foreigners they don't know the laws yes. and uh, uh, so it's better to avoid when it is banned better to avoid such yeah. things uh, this is the sand now let us come to the lamb the lamb in hindi is called memna memna it is called as a memna now again if you are new to india in india mostly the meat of the lamb is not very common mm. because we eat the goat goat family goat meat, meat is more common more yeah. common but lamb you have to ask for it you mm. have to ask for the lamb meat only then you will get the lamb but this is also very very common in uh, i think All everywhere in india, india. Yes. except for the northeast region uh, it is very very okay. common memna is very very common lamb okay so there is no restriction you can have the purses etc whatever <laughs> artifacts you want you can just buy now uh, the next is the puppy now puppy is a small baby of the dog, dog and it is called pilla in hindi it is called pilla now uh, again one thing uh, the dog is kutta pilla is dog's puppy but on the street of the india never called suppose if you find a puppy don't say it kutte ka pilla because the kutte ka pilla is again a yes slang word and uh, if somebody is it's derogatory or it's insulting yeah, for someone to be called like this it's a insulting yes. so don't call it as a kutte ka pilla it is a totally bad word uh, <laughs> on the streets of the india so be sure don't call it as a pilla just keep in your mind you can call it as a puppy Yeah. or whatever you want to say so cute and so all those things that you can go but don't say kutte ka pilla it is a bad word okay 
The next is the boar. Now boar is generally for is wild animal and it's called jungly sewer. A sewer you can uh, find in any cities, any villages of India, but uh, this the wild boar. Wild boar is called as the jungly. Jungly means wild. Jungle means the jungle. one which lives in jungle. Yeah. So it's jungly. So it is called as the jungly, jungly sewer. Jungly sewer. Again, killing wild boar needs a license. Okay. So uh, this hunting is totally prohibited. So. Uh, it happens that if you are going in the rural part of the Actually, India Actually poaching, hunting, everything, everything is banned is now, banned now. So everything. it's uh, better not to go in that yeah. way and no, avoid because it Because I am specifically telling because in many parts of the India Where the jungles are nearby and you are staying in a resort They may offer you yeah. the hunting Yes, yes Okay, yes. they may offer, they might have guns with them And they may offer you hunting as a thrill But remember, this is banned it right. is not allowed. Sometimes the tourist, please take care that sometime it may be the trap. Okay. They may offer you the hunting. You go for the hunting and their own people will come mm. and they will catch you. So it's a trap. So don't fall into the trap. Don't go in hunting anywhere in India. It is totally banned unless and until you have the proper license. Okay. Mm. Now, the chameleon. Chameleon. Now it's, again, whether it's to call it as a chameleon. Yeah. In Hindi, it is called Girgit. It can change its color. It can change its colors. Uh, generally, if you say the European style pronunciation, it's a chameleon or uh, American there style. There are different type of pronunciation yeah. nowadays. So, whatever is convenient, whatever convenient you take. To you. It's chameleon, uh, chameleon, chameleon. Chameleon, I, I feel more <laughs> uh, stylish word. So, I always <laughs> use the chameleon word. So, it can change its colors. You can find it anywhere. Now the next is the bear. Now bear, the common bear, it is called as bhalu. In Hindi, it is called as bhalu. Now the hairy uh, animal. Which yeah, it's a very hairy animal. Uh, it can be of the small size and uh, of the big size also. Uh, till ten years back, uh, you might have seen the bhalu on the roads of the cities also, like you see the the. Monkey. Uh, the now there are some people who are actually making use of these animals to take money. They make them do some tricks. Yeah. And nowadays yeah. that is also not allowed by yeah. the government. That is also not allowed by yeah. government. But yeah, some years back but they were. Some years used back to they were there. Now, if you uh, if you know the stories about the bhalu, in all the stories, the bhalu is said to be very very kind and very very, very gentle, uh, good, kind gentle but animal. actually it is not not <laughs> at all it is very wild and uh, it can even kill you okay yeah. so the next is the buffalo 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 is in hindi it is called bhans 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 again so it is a nasal, nasal word. is there bhans so buffalo is a very common in india everywhere all over the india the buffalo in Buffalo's India, yeah, there. buffalo milk and cow yeah, milk. These cow are milk, very, very common. Cow yeah. milk and buffalo, buffalo milk. milk. Now, yeah. again, don't call the bhans, the word bhans very loudly in front of any females. Because if the female is little bit healthy, those females are generally called they as bit, the bhans. They feel offended and uh, yeah. yes, they might not like if it. If the female is healthy, the generally... Maybe healthy or dark colored. Uh, so, people just for teasing purpose, for they teasing, may use the word bhans. And yeah. if the uh, man are the healthy and the black colored or dark black colored, they are called as the bhansa. <laughs> okay. So yeah. the bhans and bhansa, that is a male and female. Yes. Okay. So generally remember this thing, uh, bhans, not to say the word loudly in front of any females. Then there is a butterfly. Now butterfly in Hindi is called titli. Titli. It's a very, very beautiful, colorful uh, bird. Not bird, you can say it's an animal. And there are a lot of parks which are having lot yeah. of butterflies. Butterfly parks are developed nowadays everywhere. Everywhere. Everywhere the butterfly parks are developed mm. and uh, hundreds and thousands of species of butterfly yeah. and butterflies are there yes. in those parks. The last animal in uh, this video is a camel. Now camel in Hindi is called oot. So I'll write double U N T. So it is pronounced as oont. Oont. Or you can say as a double O also you uh, can use. Yes. Double O also you can yes. use. Oont. But the nasal word is there. N 
is there. Yes. Now the camels you will find generally in the Rajasthan, Rajasthan area. Where the desert Deserts is there. Are there it yeah. is called as a ship of the desert. And there... Uh, there camel milk is very popular. Yeah. Camel milk is very popular. It is... Uh, if you are not Again, there also it, the camel meat is been banned. Because people yeah. are killing it. So that is ban is also come nowadays. Okay. You may find somewhere the meat to be given also. Yeah. And many resorts are there. And many uh, institutions are there. Who offer the camel safaris in the desert. Yes. Camel rides. Camel, camel safaris ride. are very common. Camel ride is very uh, small distance. But camel safaris yes. uh, for the seven days... Or Continuous. eight days you are into the desert. Yeah. Some camping is there. Extremely That's very good. adventurous. Very, very nice. adventurous. If you go to uh, Rajasthan part of the India, the two main attractions are there. One is the camel safaris, and second is the Ranthambore, mm. where you can see the Royal Bengal Tiger reserves. Okay. So uh, this is about, about this some video. Some of the animals. Some yeah. of the animals. We'll see one more video about yes. the animal, common animals. There are actually so many animals, but we have tried to take out some common ones which you yeah. might be seeing around okay. you. Yeah. Because India is, uh, because of the tropical country, yes. the India has the you may find hundreds uh, so and many thousands of the varieties of animals. Yes. yes. Exactly. So uh, that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, before going, again, I'm reminding you, please subscribe the channel. Uh, like and share the video and don't forget to press the bell icon. Give your suggestions in your comment box. Yeah. So, thank you very much. Namaste. Dhaniyavad.